short video explores some very fundamental things in Coppel SM, which is to change the viewpoint in order to view the object better and to modify the scene. The four things that we talk about here are pan, which is to translate left, right, rotate the view, zoom in, zoom out, and fit to view. If you go in Coppel SM and look at the top left, upper toolbar, then you'll see these icons. So we will go through this one at a time. So I've opened Coppel SM. I'm going to create a simple shape. Let's say a cylinder. Okay. Now, if I want to zoom in, so let's start with pan first. This is translating left and right. What I need to do is click on pan, then I go to the scene and then I hold my mouse key button and with the tip rest, I move left and right in order to translate the viewpoint. Okay, so again, click the mouse button and keep it pressed and move left and right. Okay, in order to do rotation, click on the rotate icon. Again, press the mouse button and move up and down, up and down. Next, you see how to zoom. So click on zoom. And then in this case, what you do is you simply scroll up and then you go closer or zoom in and scroll out. So scroll down and so you'll be zooming away. So uh, scroll up to go closer, scroll down to go further away. Okay. And the fit to view is something which if you press, you will basically fit the cylinder in your screen. So if you fit to view, you get this. Again, you have to zoom out, scroll down. Okay. The fit to view is actually very useful in cases where you are just lost. So for example, let me just scroll out and then rotate. And so now I see nothing in the scene. Uh, so instead of hunting down where the object is, what you can do is just press fit to view and you'll be back to the scene. 